It's hard to find a rock star that hasn't done it all in Las Vegas, but KISS frontman Gene Simmons is doing something he's never done before in Sin City, showing off his artwork at a local gallery. 13 Action News' Amy Abdel Syed shares why the rock star kept his passion for art such a secret. Gene Simmons is a lot of things, an immigrant, an entrepreneur, a comic book lover. My background, I'm in a band. Uh, yeah, and he's in one of the biggest rock bands of all time. Pretty much everyone knows who the KISS frontman is. We wear more makeup and higher heels than you ever wore. That's a statement of fact. I can confirm that is correct. But what so many people don't know, at least not until recently, is he has another creative passion too. I'm Gene Simmons and believe it or not, I paint. Gene's first ever public art showing is on October 22nd and 23rd inside an amazing gallery at the Venetian. That is hand drawn by me. If you're curious enough to see his work in person, there's a good chance you'll get to meet the man himself. I'm gonna show up. I don't know about you guys, I'm coming. While it is his debut art show, Gene says he started doodling and drawing decades ago when he was just eight years old. I have hundreds and hundreds of what I call doodles. So it's a combination of pen and ink, Sharpies, paint, watercolors, uh, sort of graffiti spray cans, anything I can get my hands on. I asked him why he kept his art so low key for so long. I didn't think anybody cared. He says taking a pause from touring during the pandemic helped reignite his passion for art. The pandemic gave me a chance to be up in Canada with not a lot of people or media and given to my, you know, sort of private secret dreams, which is I've been doodling all my life. Gene pulled his art out of storage, closed himself off, and started experimenting. Then I thought, well, why don't I just dive into the deep end of the pool and see what I can do with acrylic and paint and other materials. And that's what I did. Gene has no professional training and says he takes inspiration from artists ranging from Jackson Pollock to Andy Warhol, even comic books. And it shows. There's a lot of variety in his work. I have no style. I have none. I've been call that many times. Gene, you got no style. While it's true his art fits into several different categories, it's almost as if no style is his style. If there's one thing I learned from talking to him, Gene Simmons does what he wants. I mean, I lead my life that way. Here, ask me a question. Any question. Ask me what time it is. <laughs> Glad you asked me that question. On October the 14th, we're going to be here at Animazing. It doesn't matter what anybody asks you, just say what you want to say. That life's lesson comes through in his work. There are no rules, whether you're writing songs or writing books or the creation of stuff. I take a look at every day as this might be the only day I'm ever going to be alive. Use it, play, have fun, enjoy life. Gene says the intention behind his artwork is pretty simple. Try to make the day less boring by doing cool stuff. And his approach is to not overthink it. Sometimes the best thing to do is put a knapsack on your back and just go out on a journey and not know where you're going. I really didn't know what I was doing, but I like it. Check out Gene's work and learn more about the showing on ktmv.com slash things to do. For How To Vegas, I'm Amy Abdel Syed.